Anvil is a platform for building full-stack web apps with nothing but Python. Here's the UI for a simple Hello World app. Usually, you would use JavaScript to write client-side code and make the Say Hi button interactive, but with Anvil, you can use Python. In the Anvil IDE, double-clicking the button will open the client code editor and create a Python function. When a user clicks the button in the running app, the function will run in the browser. Inside your button click function, you can call Anvil's alert function to display an alert that says hello to your users. To test the code you've just written, click run at the top of the IDE, enter a name and click the say hi button. Your function will be called and it will display the alert. Let me show you how client-side Python in Anvil works. In Anvil, your app's web pages are made up of one or more forms. Your forms are made up of components, such as buttons, text boxes, panels, and so on. To write client-side code that dictates the behavior or the styling of your app's components, you can click on the code view in the form editor. Both forms and components are represented in code as Python objects. This means you can write Python code to change the component's attributes. For example, you could change the color of the button. In client code, you can import and use Python libraries like DateTime. You could use the DateTime library to log when a user says hello. As Anvil apps use Python on the client side as well as the server side, you can call server functions and pass them the Python objects you've been working with in client code. That was client side Python in under 100 seconds. Please leave a comment down below to suggest other Anvil topics you'd like to see us cover. To learn more about client side Python with Anvil, please follow the links in the description. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more Python content.